Getting your COVID vaccine could become an annual thing. That's according to the White House. Yeah, they say that you can get improved protection from updated booster shots. Nine News reporter Jordan Chavez joins us with more details. And so they're saying that this is going to be like getting a flu shot. A yeah, that's flu ex shot. exactly right, Gary and Corey. You know, just like those flu shots, the COVID shots are going to be updated each year to really better match whichever strains of the virus are going around. Now, the White House's COVID response coordinator says the only exception here would be if there, quote, weren't any new variant curveballs that, of course, would affect a majority of people here in the U.S. Now, the White House is calling this an important shift in the fight against COVID, and they say it's a significant moment in the government scaling back its pandemic response. At this point, though, it's not clear if these annual boosters will remain free for anyone who wants one as they have been throughout the pandemic. And since vaccinations are no longer required at a lot of businesses, it's also not clear how many people are expected to continue to get a shot each year. The latest data from the CDC actually shows since 2010, less than half of the U.S. population got their flu shot each year. Experts say this is a significant step, though, excuse me, toward our future and living with COVID. For a large majority of Americans, we are moving to a point where a single annual COVID shot should provide a high degree of protection against serious illness all year. So right now, the current recommendation from the CDC is for teenagers and adults to get the most up to date booster shot, which does target the Omicron sub variants as we've talked about for about the past week. Now, these boosters are, 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 by the way, available right here in Colorado at this time. Yeah, just today, right? Is like, I think the first day or tomorrow. yeah, I believe so. You're right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, we've been asking you, do you plan to get COVID shots every year? Kind of like the flu shot, as Jordan was just talking about 74% saying yes this morning, 26% saying no, we have about I I think 80 votes already this morning. It's really interesting because the CDC says that since 2010, less than half right. the adult population gets the flu shot. But it seems like more people with the, would get COVID booster shots every year. Right. I think there's going to be some planning around this, right? I yeah. think we've kind of seen, depending on which, how your immune system reacts to the different booster shots, I might have planned mine a little bit differently. Yeah. I, I do admit I forgot to get my flu shot this last year because I had a strong reaction to the booster shot. Mm -hmm. uh, Dr. Coley says you can get them together, though. And, and maybe and that it, would have been very safe. And that, it's just more convenient if you do Maybe that. that should be my plan of action because I didn't get my flu shot. And guess who got the flu? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it was terrible. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, last year, a lot, and last two years actually, a lot of people were wearing masks right. and social distancing, right. and a lot of places were closed down. So we didn't have a big flu thing, right? For that reason, but this year uh, they think that the flu could be coming back with a vengeance. So, yeah. so everybody be warned. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Jordan, thank you.